Um, hi you guys. My name is Mary Next for One. And um well I meet something for, for my doctor, my lady doctor, because um I made a special paper bead bracelet and um I made this because it has a special color in it and I made this for her because she she saved my life and they helped me fight fight my cancer. And I use a facial, um, I use a facial, um, um, mod porridge or something, so it's laminating glue, and I, and I use the nail polish first, and I double coat it with, um, glade, diamond glade or something I use, and I use Milani for the, um, glitter, I show what I use. I use this for glitter, and it's called... Daisy, Daisy Diamond, and this is number four zero. So I use this, so you could tell. I show you. See, it's glitter on it, so you could tell I use that, and I double coat it with diamond glitter again. And first, I polish. I like this um beads dry. If um I use a wood glue over this, then I use nail polish. Then I use glue glue and I put nail polish. Then after I let it dry, the nail polish. Then I put um diamond clay something I bought at the store and then I let it dry for two weeks. Then I put some these glitter Milani nail polish glitter. Then I let it dry. Then I double coat it with nail polish top coat. Then I put diamond glaze over it. Now, look at this. It's so hard enough color them. Cause I don't want to use the paint. Cause paint is not good for the um paper bead. So I use a fashion nail polish. So this is my nail polish I use. Then I use diamond glaze. That, that I bought from a craft store. Then I use um Milani, um Diamond Dazzle number four, forty. Yeah, this one. Maybe show you again. Maybe if you can see it. Here's the brand. If you can see it, I love this color. Yeah, so I use that. Then I I use uh, nail polish. These. Uh, wet and wild. That's what I painted with. Wet and wild. Then I use my um LA color top coat. Then I put diamond glade over this. And now, after that, look at this. I show you some. I already made some. Um, here, let me. And um, my friend of mine, you know, she tried make it, but she asked me what I use, and I told her I use um diamond. Glade or mud porridge, something like that. Those kind. And it's good to buy some toothpicks when you do these. So you get the toothpicks at um with Walmart for fifty eight cents and two hundred fifty package, or you you get this at Costco, any place you shop at. Get I go to Walmart, it's more cheaper or nine nine cents there. Or Dollar Tree, I love Dollar Tree. See. Yeah, diamond gray see guitar. I bought this at some craft store. Oh, it's hard. Okay, see? You can tell it's hard, so. Okay. You have to let this dry for one or two weeks. If you don't let it dry, it could get sticky on the hand. And the way, that's what I'm telling you. So always remember, don't touch the diamond gray. So you have to let this dry for... I got it off on my finger using hot water and soap. So, or use a punch remover to get it off. That's what I did. So, see, up this dry. And um, first use a wood glue on your paper bead. Let it dry. The top coat it with um diamond glaze. And then after that, put some nail polish and decorate wherever you want. Like I did, see, with nail polish. The, and then you put some glitter, glitters. Oh, what 
like glitter like this from that price glitter the wet one wet and wild one or milani any brand you use you could use a mac um the glitter you could use that for mac and um or mac nail polish and just like this and after they like the the nail polish dry put some glitter on it like the dry put them um you could use mud mud what do you call it um pot pot porridge or you call those bottles they have this great bottle or you could use the um, mud porridge bottle or you could use um diamond clay and you let this sit for two weeks that's what i did see it's all dried and hard so okay bye my name is mary next time for one please watch my channel and all my videos and please um Describe me. Goodbye. Okay,